Here's a little thing about me. This is something no one ever believes this, but until I was 25, I never masturbated. No one ever believes me, but I'll prove it to you. This is, I'm not, why would I lie? Everyone's just like, you lied. Why would I lie? You know what I did with my extra 12,000 hours in my life? I memorized the capital of every country in the world. You ready to get turned on, ladies? You're going to be gushing like the Ganges. I know the rivers, too. Uh, <laughs> This is true. Shout out a country, I'll tell you the capital of any country. Vietnam, Vietnam Hanoi, easy. Luxembourg, it's Luxembourg, you fucking idiot. Yeah. Uh, what do you say? Azerbaijan, Baku, it's on the Caspian Sea. It's one of the biggest oil ports in the world. Is anyone wet yet? You wet yet? I fucking started her up for you, dude. <laughs> I got her going for you, Dan. Give me another couple more countries. Canada. Canada. Come on, dude. You just don't know. Ottawa. I'll tell you the capital of... Tell me a Canadian province. I know the capital of every province. Manitoba. Manitoba, Winnipeg. Nunavut. Nunavut. Uh, Iqaluit. Whoa! Yukon, Whitehorse. Northwest Yellowknife. Right, yeah, yeah, your dick's getting a little too hard, isn't it? Yeah. I also want you to know this isn't autism, this is loneliness. Uh, give me one more. Cambodia, Phnom Penh, Qatar, it's actually Qatar, you fucking Islamophobic bitch. Uh, <laughs> you think I gave up masturbating just to know the capital of Cambodia? I fucking know everything, dude. I know how to pronounce them all. One more. Kazakhstan, Astana, it used to be Almaty until recently. They wanted to centralize their bureaucracy. There, I did it. This is what you two could do this if you ignore all your sexual urges. When I was in high school, I got a boner and just scrunched them back like a <laughs> creaky Civil War accordion. <laughs> Every six months, I had to get de-juiced like that blueberry girl in Willy Wonka. <laughs> I know everything about the world cap. I know everything about every U.S. president, too. Shout out a U.S. president. I'll tell you a fact about a U.S. president. Rutherford. Rutherford B. Hayes. Straight white male. <laughs> Am I wrong? Am I wrong? Do another one. Tubman. What? Tubman. Tubman? Do you think she was a president? Man, that is an indictment of the Minnesota public education system right there. That's actually incredibly progressive that you think Harriet Tubman could have been president in 1870. What a, how far our country's gone backwards that we... We, have, we couldn't even elect a white woman the other year, and, but Harriet Tubman was president in 1872. That was an incredible thing, and I won't forget that for a long time. They didn't even put her on the $20 bill yet, but she was already president. <laughs> president Tubman, why not? I wish that was true. That's a fun alternate history to live in. You just live in a world that you want to live in. The Holocaust never happened. Tubman was president. That's just the world I live in, man. <laughs> I like that. Oh. Man, I did a good job with that. That was really good. That could have gone awry, but I did a really good job. Okay.